Hi, I'm Eric Tejeda, Head of Marketing, and with me today is Eric Holtzclaw, Chief Strategist for Possible Now. We're talking about the basics of preference management. Today, the question I wanted to ask is, what's the importance of having an opt-down strategy? So an opt-down strategy is one of the most effective things a company can put in place to stem the tide of opt-outs they may be receiving from their customers on communications. And an opt-down strategy can save the communication with almost 60% or greater of your customers. So we'll see an opt-down strategy very effective. It's the first thing that we recommend, even beyond putting in a preference center or doing other kind of collection. It does require that you understand all the other mechanics of preference management, so you can't just start with an opt-down strategy. You have to know the rest of the things you're building towards. But thinking about an opt-down strategy first is going to be an effective way to start seeing the results and the payoff of putting preference management in place. Well, and if you're saving 60%, that seems like a good place to start. Well, it's the difference between 60% or losing 100% of your right. customers. Yeah. yeah. Well, great. Well, thanks for the, uh, sharing that tidbit with us today.